Hey Pop Fanatics, uh, this is Hellhole here. Uh, just like I said, today I'm doing a video of Kamehakan 2019. Uh, I went there with my son. Uh, here's the tag that I got. I know it's been long since I, I went to Kamehakan, but like I said, here's the pass that I went for Saturday. It's pretty neat tags. I saw some for the three days, VIPs, so they're pretty cool. They did. I like how they did this to, uh, this year. Last year it was just a wristband, but this year they, they went out with this. So I'm definitely keeping this, and if they do it next year, I'm keeping the one for that next year, and the next year, and the next year, and next year, So because these are so cool. Um, so I just want to talk about, uh, like I said, Kamehakan. Wow, it was a great experience. I went with my son. Um, funny thing, when I actually got in there, uh, I met one of uh, two of my YouTubers that I follow, uh, Dinox and SS Goshen. Uh, funny thing, because last year I met them too, and it was like, what, 10 minutes after I got into the, to the convention, and I bumped into them last year, and this year, funny thing, same thing happened <laughs> as soon as i walked in they were right there i'm like oh hey guys so they recognized me and everything so we stood there talking and uh, we took a couple of pictures so it was pretty neat and um so they left they went they went to uh, do their own thing and i just kept on walking checking out the the vendors and everything and i found the pop toy uh it's kind of hard to choose from all the pop toys they had there was different stands and I found this that caught my eye, a Xenomorph, a blue metallic Xenomorph. It was an exclusive Xenomorph for 20 bucks, so not a bad price. It's pretty good. Let's see, we got it here. And uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is the Xenomorph from the first Alien movie. Um, I just want to say thanks to Nerd Time. These are the guys that, uh, this guy here, he, uh, he's the one that, uh, who I went and he got me this, the Xenomorph. Uh, if you guys want to buy some pops from him, uh, I'll see if I could put the website in the bottom so you guys can check him out. Uh, if you take a picture of his product and uh, post it on social media, either Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, um, tag him and he'll probably PM you and send you like a, a discount code for 10% off for your next purchase on the website. And he'll hook you up, and um, and like it says here, they should do free shipping. So check these guy. This you can check this guy out. He's got pretty good prices on pops. So that was a pretty good experience there. And then um, this other guy. Let's see. Here we go. CV. This guy here, he had uh, some art, fan art that he did. Uh, very unique. I posted like I like uh, posted on on Instagram. A lot of pictures that I posted there. This is one of them. Uh, if you manage to go to my Instagram, you get to see where I posted. Where is uh, uh, what was it? It was a Goku. It was Goku Super uh, Super Saiyan God foil. These guys. These guys have talent. I like how they did the art. How they uh, Im implied that uh, foil on that art. So it's pretty cool. You can check them out too. Uh, I'm see if I could put their website too, so you guys could check out the website. And if you want, if you see some art that you like, you could buy from them. And uh, they had another bin too uh, from a different vendor, where it was like a big bin, and they were for twenty bucks, grab whatever you want. So I told my son, grab whatever you want, and what better than Gyarados? So for twenty bucks, I mean, shoot, this is a good deal. It's a really cool Gyarados that he got. And he loves the heck out of it. So I was like, go ahead and go for it, man. If that's what you like, take it. And he sure did. I met a lot of cosplayers. as Like I said before, on my Instagram, you can see all the pictures. Uh, Bulma's. Uh, I met uh, one that was uh, well, uh, your Roshi. A Roshi, actually, there was that Roshi I took pictures of. Uh, I met him last year, and I met him this year again. So that was pretty neat. And uh, who else did I meet? I met... Uh, Rene Garcia and Mario Castañeda. Rene Garcia is the one that does Vegeta in Spanish, the voice dub. And Mario Castañeda is the one that does Goku in English. I mean, in Spanish, sorry. And I grew up watching Dragon Ball over there in Mexico. And when I saw them, I was just like, whoa. It was, it was a great experience. 
and they did the voice in Spanish. Vegeta was telling me, hey, so what do you want me to sign? And this man on the Vegeta voice, and I was just like, oh, I was just geeking out. So I'm like, cool. I said, nah, I just want to take a picture. He's like, ah, okay, come on by then. So we took a picture and everything, so it was pretty neat. Goku, he did the Kamehameha in Spanish, and I was like, oh, yes, it was a great experience. And, um, and another thing, let's see here. I met a YouTuber, too. I was taking pictures with this girl. Uh, I forgot her name. But anyways, she was dressed as Bulma, and she had her boyfriend that has a YouTube channel. He has pretty good videos in there. Spike Reviews. And he's done some uh, interviews with some of the voice actors. I saw the one that he did with Boo and Mr. Same. That was pretty. That was a cool video. Spike. That was a good video. I liked it. I, and I was in your video, too, so there you go. If you guys want to check it out, same thing. I'll see if I can put the link so you guys could check out his video. So it was pretty cool. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's the back of the card. So, yeah. So, like I said, I met a lot of people that day. And he handed, he handed out this uh, Brawly trading card. And it's a two-sided one, so that's pretty neat. Thanks for the card. Still got it on the on the wrapper, so. Let me see here. There you go. You see it? Right there. So, and there's another table. They had a lot of stickers. I mean, a lot. And I was like, I don't know what to choose from. So, I was like, $3, I believe. I got, this is one that my son chose. I don't know if it's too small for the camera, but... And then he chose this one here. And the ones I got was this one. This has always been my favorite right here. Vegeta. I always like that pose right there. I got a shirt with Vegeta. With, it's over 9,000. So this one's pretty neat. Super Saiyan 3 Goku. To me, that's one of my top one uh, uh, transformation. Uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Too bad it just takes too much of his stamina and all that so but it's pretty strong and then Goku on this flying Nimbus so yeah and then I met another girl uh, another girl I mean another voice actor actress her name is Tiffany she's the one that does the voice acting of OG uh, Bulma I met her and she gave me her autograph and the coolest thing about this is that uh, I mentioned her that uh, I'm friends with uh, SS Goshen. So she was like, oh, cool. So basically you're part family because they both know each other. So she was really nice. She gave me a big hug and everything. So thanks, Tiffany. I love the sticker and thanks for the autograph and everything. So you're really cool. I enjoyed meeting you. Same goes with Mario and Renee. You guys were just awesome, awesome, awesome. So then Gosha did a, a meet and greet. Well, kind of like a meeting green a little in a certain area of the of uh of the convention and as soon as i bumped into her again you know to say hi uh we were there talking she did a live stream and so did dinox he did a live stream too and i was there with them and talking to him and appearing in the video and as you'll see if uh if you guys uh go to their to their youtube channels um and she was nice enough to give me a sticker she was giving stickers uh to all their uh, it says Goshen fans, which they call uh, Goshen Force. So that's her website. Well, actually, let's see. Yeah, with that name right there, you can follow her on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. And what she does, uh, she talks about anything Dragon Ball. Uh, she has Pop Toys of Dragon Ball, which is awesome. The best, the the one that I like that she has is the fusion of Gotenks and Trunks. Goten and Trunks. When they do the little dance, she has that pop. It, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I think a fan sent that to her. So it, it's a, it's really a cool pop. So uh, Dinox, he talks about Nintendo, anything from Amiibos and all that kind of stuff. Um, so you could go see him. Like I said, see if I could put his YouTube channel there. And that is it. That's all I have for today. Um, just want to say that uh, don't forget to hit that that like button want to see those thumbs up right there hit that bell and don't forget to subscribe want to see those subscribers I'm almost what 17 subscribers so far so not bad if I can get more please I would really really appreciate it that'll be that'll be really really cool so just uh, all right so that's all I got and um, I'll see what I could do for next week or or whenever I get a chance so 
Y'all take care. Bye.